Hello everyone, I'm Gina R. and I'm back with a mail call. Well, I purchased something from AG Shopsticks and I can't wait to show you. So let me go ahead and get this box open and let's see what's inside. Now, before I reveal what's in the box, let me give you a little bit of background information about this purchase. My friend AG Shopsticks posted on one of the Discord channels that he was selling some framed items because he needed to make room on his wall for his latest collection, which is beautiful. And I'll leave a link up here on top to that collection. So these are things that I'm gonna add to my collection. Now I've previously have bought um, these frames from him. And so I thought these would go perfect with that. So let me go ahead open up the box and get the frames out so I can show you what I purchased. Okay. The first frame is the American Indian. It has an Indians in the center photo. Along the sides, it has Indian head scents and Buffalo nickels. Down below, it has a little bit of information and it does have some stamps, which is really cool. So that's the first one. Let me go ahead and get the next one. The next one is the Pioneers. On top in the center, you'll see a United States of America postage 10 cent stamp. That is really nice design. You'll have some information that goes around the stamps that are below. And then along the side here, you really can't see them. You have some Mercury Dimes. So this is nice. The next one is the Pony Express. And I like that card. That is really neat. It has some information about the Pony Express. And along the side here, it has some Mercury Dimes. So this is really cool. And I do love Mercury Dimes. That's my favorite coin. So let me go ahead and sit that one right here. The next framed item, I got it because of my friend William Finds Pennies. He's always challenging me to grow as a coin collector. And so I got this one because of him. It's the story of the proof coin. And so I thought, wow, this would be really cool to have on my wall. And it does have a proof set down below. This is a Philadelphia proof set. And it's a 1962. So that is cool. Okay, I'm running out of space. Let me go ahead and fix these really quick. I got two more to show you. So let me make room for them. The next one is the silver story. So along the side there of the coin, it has information. It does have a silver certificate down below. And this is... Oh, I can't see really well. I'll look up in just a minute. But it does have a silver half dollar, silver quarter. It does have some silver granulates, a silver nickel, and a silver dime. And this is a 1957, uh, 1957, excuse me there for that blunder, a 1957 B silver certificate. Awesome. So let me go ahead and slide this over here so I can make room for the last one. The last one is the Symbols of Liberty. This shows a half dollar, 
a one dollar a quarter and also the obverse of a half dollar so this is in honor of the 1976 uh, coin actually it's from 1776 through the 1976 which would be the bicentennial coins so that is cool i cannot wait to put these up on my wall in my office so this is a really in my opinion this is a great addition to my collection especially since these frames have information on them about the different coins and they have stories and i really am in a lot into history and learning it's all about learning more about my hobby I want to thank you for watching, and until next time, happy hunting, happy collecting. Bye, everyone.